Hey, can you guys hear me? Okay, that seems like it's working. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna be playing some more um, Undertale AU RPG. So um, yeah, I decided to play this more because I'm. I uh, see that uh, this gets more than my average videos. Also, checking up on things. This many views for this video right here. So, uh, yeah. Okay, continuing the game. Last time on um, Undertale AU RPG, we defeated X Gaster, which I now have a really good melee weapon. Um, now I was surprisingly, this one has way more damage than, um, this one. In general, this one took longer to kill. Also, I got this, I got this one from a 74 million HP, and I don't know if this one, how many HP, um, a true X-Gaster was, but, um, I got a good melee weapon. Plus, this one has like a five second cooldown, and this one has a one second cooldown. So, it's it's a good weapon overall. So, um, last time off camera, I beat Lancer. Here he is. So, now I'm planning on beating. Bonkers, um, wait, so, Soul of Kindness, Temi Flakes, Papyrus Spaghetti, yeah, that's, that's my setup. I hate this. Took me about, like, ten minutes to kill him. Yesterday, so uh, I'm not I'm not doing that dude again. Quick before that dude defeats um what's his name? The king. This is one of the best Undertale games on Roblox. It's really creative, and it must have taken a lot of effort for people to, for the developers to make. In a way, this game this game is just so fun to play. Like you can wait like 
most of the times you can literally get like so triggered at bosses and that happens a lot for people like me. Let me just uh Soul of Kindness. Soul of Kindness costs like 200 million um, gold, but it's worth it. Okay, so we beat that dude. Disappointed. Didn't really get a reward from it. some other bosses at the end or blah blah blah. I'm actually gonna do some skilled skill points or skilled points, blah blah blah. Dun, 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 dun What the what does it do? Sixty five thousand damage. I don't need that. Sixty-five thousand damage. One hundred fifty thousand damage. One hundred twenty. Yeah, then that. Yeah, no. Um. Gonna get my stuff ready. Sorry if I'm going slow. Bro, I can't wait till I can beat the sus dude. But first, I want to get all the items that I possibly can. Because I want some overpowered items here before I uh, reset. Because a lot of people are saying that when you reset, you don't lose all your items. My one, one of my friends said it doesn't, but all the other people, and a person with 32 resets, said that it keeps your items on the first reset. So, I'm pretty confident that that is true. And a person with 11 resets. And somebody with 4, blah, blah, blah. Sure, it takes a lot. What? I just like flung across the map. It's weird. Amogus. And it'll be especially easy for especially easy for um people to get higher level and defeat bosses because you'll have like these weapons that you did after defeating like bosses with like millions of HP. Yeah, one thing I want to do before I reset is actually try and some of the no mercy bosses. Because it's gonna reset my battle points is what people said. So I only started get battle bat I only started getting battle points yesterday. Even though I could have done that like a 
two days ago, like a, d a day ago, because um, mm -hmm. I was level 2000, like a few days ago. But I decided not to go in the world yet. So, wait. how much do I need for the weapon that I want? Mm -hmm. And keep in mind, I'm getting S, S points or skill points or whatever they're called. Spin points. Okay, next spin. Spin points. That's what they're called. Think, like, a lot of hits, I guess. That was unintentionally laggy. cannot hold it anymore. My inventory has begun beyond... Wait, has begun... has gone beyond... its limit. Appreciate the five second cooldown because it was a it was a heck of a lot to beat the boss that had 74 million health, but um you could at least at least give us a zero second cooldown because it was a 74 million health boss. You hear me? 74 million. Also if you jump on Tem's head back here, you can, um, get a... What is it? You can get, um... You can get... What do I call it? You can fight true X-Gaster. Now I'm warning you, it might take up to 20 minutes. Like it did to me.
Digger, Blaster, Hardcore, Game Black, or Game Master Black, Soul of Kindness, Temi Flakes, Papyrus Spaghetti. I know it's Papyrus. My my friend Hayden, I'm pretty sure you guys know him, but he calls Papyrus Pep Papyrus. Papyrus. And I'm like, it's Papyrus. He's like, okay. Because we both know it's Papyrus, but this is Papyrus. I don't blame him. I would say that too. Everybody here has like almost a reset. Or has at least one reset. And like so many people here have like these knives. Or these amogo saucy knives that I want. Because they're all of P. You hear me? OP! When something's OP, you want it. And yes, I mean overpower. Everybody's speaking in abbreviations today. Like, this generation. Dude, I saw this person before. When I was fighting disbelief. Her name was Amori. There's two Sansas in the server, and I pointed out that there was someone named Omori. Tricky, ticky, bum bum bum. Ticky. This. This might sound very cringe, but this is my torn voice. That's what he sounds like to me. That's that's what his F and F voice sounds like. He is from Ed's world. No denying that. I personally I personally like Ed like love Ed's world myself. I'm new to watching it, but I wish they I wish they would continue the series. But at least it's rising back to popularity again because of the tournament in Friday Night Fun, which is like a huge game. FNF might be the game that like just dies and comes back like Among Us, but hopefully that doesn't happen. I don't want FNF to die. I want it to be like Mario, one of those games that is like classic. And like every every person will remember. Like in like years from now, people will be like, I grew up with Friday Night Funkin'. It was a really game where you have to press arrow keys. It had some amazing songs. And all the characters speak in little beat bop noises. It was pretty cool. OMG, this game is so addicting. And then the dude's like, yeah, it is. <coughs> kind of like Undertale. I'm so close! I actually found this out on a YouTube video, but um, somebody said that somebody said that um, um somebody said that in the versus Shaggy mod, the voice clips were actually him saying the ghost train. So, we were right about him saying train. Though, it still kind of says he, it still kind of sounds like he's saying Dorito, Dreidel, Dreidel, or like, Tray and Train. 
so you're right about train. Ghosto train, eh? Resets. Oh my lord. I see what they're doing here. there is but there probably might be but if there is a boss that literally gives me 100 battle points I would do it even if it was like a million I would do it I really want 1000 battle points I really like really good. wait how many battle points did I get Three seventy five. It gives me 10. 10. Ooh, um, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. At least it's better than 5. me of like the super fast sound and like like when I shoot those blasters and like wait speaking wait this is disbelief pirates right the master tale Lucas boss fight that I made was a remix of a, of a loop of disbelief papyrus attacks and I edited the dialogue at the beginning because I thought I was smart but I was actually being stupid. Because people could see that it was a remix, so they're like, oh, this is just a copy. N not worth playing. 
and to be honest, it is not worth playing. It is cringy. The drawing is terrible. I can do better than that. I don't know why. I just make it. Makes me look like a weird person. Or a fool. <coughs> Yo, this video is 25 minutes long. I'm gonna try to make it an hour. Now, um, if you just heard what I said, maybe around 30 minutes or 40. But I just want to play this game like for all the time and then like upload it because I want I want you guys to experience what uh, what I do when I play this game. Now this isn't like an everyday break play, play through. Also, what's in the item shop? <laughs> I just literally gave them a head start. have like lots of resets in it. It's amazing. Also, I don't know, but I think you can get over 6,000 maybe, or maybe you have to get a reset. I don't know. I just really want to like reset, but like at the same time, I don't. Cause like, I'm gonna have to do every single stinking boss again. Well, I won't have to do all my true ex gaster or ex gaster. Or ex gaster phase one. Or, what do you call it? Um, Stronger Sands with the 74 million HP. Because, uh, I got a. People say that it'll keep my weapons, so I won't have to worry about them, right? Or will it to keep my weapons? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. That's why I feel suspicious of people telling me that that's true. Time for a uh, dust trust. This dude's gonna be insanely hard, isn't he? Yeah. I hate it. I hate it already. How much does he give me though? So I got 452 right now. <laughs> So that's what I was doing with the Moby earlier. Whatever I bought and for spin points. That makes sense. So I could have gotten that way before at 3000 on um, level. Because I could have gone to the code. I mean the, the other world then got battle points and I here's the thing the other world I was expecting the other world to actually be like a whole new game 
like a whole new Undertale AU RPG with more AUs and like not just like Sans. So like there was like way more. Like Tara fan games, like Sans fan games, Papyrus fan games, maybe TS Papyrus, I don't know, Team Swap, Team Switch. I don't know. But I guess it was just like a grinding place. Well, I wouldn't say grinding place. Also, guys, if you want like lots and lots of like um, XP, I would recommend you in Underfell, if you're over level 3050, you should try doing Poi, Poi, Pi, and um, Bob. Because they give you lots of um, XP. Hey, the guy from yesterday who uh, helped me defeat X True X Gaster is joining the server. This game is X X Dark Shadon One Two Three. Pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. Question. I'm just gonna have a friendly conversation. I don't know. Conversation with nobody. Um, do you guys watch Murder? The Undertale streamer? Or he does Undertale videos. He's new to fun Friday Night Funkin'. He's been playing it for about a month or, or so. He posted a video today of him playing the imposter mod, the versus imposter. Also, if you know Friday Night Funkin', Witty is no introduction. Like, legit. Like, he needs no introduction. Like, this is Witty from Friday Night Funkin' mod. 
no, it's like, okay, this is witty. And like, you immediately know who it is by looking at it. I'm excited to see what that is. before because I'm it needs well first you go in the other world and then the skill things need um a lot of points. Well, I mean six thousand level so if I was level three thousand I wouldn't I can be able to go in the skill box so I wouldn't have a skill but I have a frog in it. it. Did, 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 did. Also, I'm pretty sure a lot of you know this, but I was really dumb. And I'm pretty sure anyone would have known it, know, knew this, but um, I was uh, fighting stuff, blah, blah, blah. And I, I realized Oh, you know, I'm level, I'm level. like I was so dumb I was like wait I need XP to level up <laughs> I'm 
I know this video is 40 minutes long already, but I want to keep it that way. So for some reason, the hair that I normally wear in Roblox won't blow it in like any game anymore, so I'm using this hair. Overall, I like it. Trust is kind of a troll, like somebody said. Somebody actually said he was a troll. Like, not like troll, mm -hmm. like, 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 uh, the trolls, mm -hmm. like, like a goblin, like a troll with ears, like. second I was thinking of Dobby, Dobby from Harry Potter, the house elf. I have enough for Asgore. Dun, dun. Stats for our. 
say how do you dodge, but you just use the inside side of the jump over.